hogs on the mile planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body old school for low. Purple rim, seven seven cutty, black with the purple strip. So, New Orleans Saints versus the Ravens. Ravens versus the New Orleans Saints. Now this game is going. I think it's actually really going to be a, a good game. It's a couple of um, players um, um, I'm interested in to, uh, seeing um, play this game. Um, I can't give you all a hundred percent for us. Obviously, if they're gonna play, um, we know for the New Orleans, we know Michael Thomas is out. We know for the Ravens, Bateman is out. And both of those wide receivers are out for the season. Now, on top of that, um, I see on their injury report, I see Mark Ingram is uh, doubtful. So we don't know on that. Uh, we know J.K. obviously is going to miss, miss uh, time. And for as Gus the Bus, I don't know. I really don't know. I haven't really heard anything. I don't know. Mark Ingram, Master Mark Ingram, Mandrews, Mark, Mark uh, Andrews. Um, I I wouldn't play him. I wouldn't play him. Um, but knowing the Ravens, knowing their front office, knowing their Hobbs and his medical staff. Um. He might end up playing. You just never know. You you never know. And uh, on a little side note, I know some people didn't agree with me, which is cool. It's cool. Now I had one person in the comments was very rude, but you know that's 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 life. We, um, there's a lot of good people in this world, and there's a lot of uh, what's the word, um, idiots in this world. Um, they just want to be rude to people for, for no reason. And we all run to those type of people every day. We just got to continue to pray for them. And hopefully that light bulb in their head goes off where they like, you know what? I'm being a jerk. Let me fix myself. Anyway, um, it's going to be interesting to see Mark Andrews play. If he does play, I wouldn't play him. I know some people was like, let, let likely shine. We'll see if he likely can do it again, because the Saints has a lot of injuries. They have a lot of injury. Jarvis uh, Landry is questionable. Um, he participated in showing that he participated uh, in practice. He was limited, though, in practice. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, so it's going to be uh, interesting. I forgot they had Trevor Penning. Um, he's injured reserve. He's IR, though. But, yeah, it's going to be interesting to see because Marshawn Lattimore is questionable. I believe he's not playing. And if Marshawn Lattimore was out there, he would be on whoever the Ravens put out there as wide receiver. I know Devin DuVernay. I know Deshaun Jackson. Is, they saying he's active, so hopefully he's playing. Um, yeah, they, he is playing. I don't know why I said hopefully he is playing. Uh, I know they said the, um, uh, what's that? Um, Ojabo is playing. Um, you know, Bowser is playing. Now, speaking of Ojabo, though, if so many people hyped about Ojabo, you know, they, they believe he's going to be our savior. You know, and that's that's their opinion, and I can respect that. But me, on the other hand, if you ask my opinion for the Ojabo, let's just see what he do. I already predicted he's gonna get more sacks than Owe, and that's that's not high because I believe Owe has what one sack for the entire season so far. Our best pass rusher is a man that is nearing retirement in Houston. Yeah, and Houston is killing it, and I love it. But yeah, just think about that. This man is near retirement. Mm -mm -mm. But anyway, 
I'm not putting a lot of um, stock into Ojabo. Just like likely, yeah, we uh, it took a while. It took a while for likely just to have one good game. Don't expect a lot from Ojabo. He's going to be on limited snaps. Um, you know, but it's just uh, hopefully say look at this game and have a good game because uh, it's going to be interesting. Deshaun Jackson, Monday night. He would come on a Monday night football. Hopefully, Fountain of Youth, get some Fountain of Youth in the Gatorade. Because <laughs> uh, <laughs> hopefully he can kill it. Uh, he can go out there and kill it and just stretch the field, really. Stretch the field. Hopefully we have um, Prochet or Wallace or um, Dev. You know, Dev, Dev get more chances. Uh, hopefully we see less Pat Ricard. Less pay record, meaning better play, in my opinion. Because I seen one play last week. Pat record after Lamar said hut. I'm going off topic a little bit. If you're, if you're new to my channel, hey, this ain't nothing new to you. You know what I'm saying? But Lamar said hut. Pat record literally on a, like one yard behind the line was going on the out like her screen and he just raised his hand up like he just opened. Bro, where are you going? You ain't going nowhere, dude. You ain't a fast runner. You can't juke people like that. But anyway, I just wanted to say that little side note. But anyway, um, yeah. So it's going to be a good game. Hopefully Ingram can play. Um, Lattimore, no. Michael Thomas, we know he's out for the season. Um, what do you say about Michael Thomas? I didn't even see. Uh, oh, he needs surgery on dislocated second toe on his right foot. Oh, God. Oh, man, that's pain. Shout out to the big homie, though. That's pain, though. But, yeah, I think it's going to be a good game. I don't think the Ravens going to blow them out, even though Andy Dalton is going to be playing. And we have a tremendous amount of history with Andy Dalton. But, you know, some of them games... It's going to be interesting because uh, Mike McDonough had a form. He's been going slightly, in my opinion, he's been going slightly up um, for as his, um, his coaching, I would say. His coaching, his game strategy is going a slight up. And not too many hiccups like, like they was having, but... One thing I'm looking forward to for the defense is Raquan Smith. I can't wait to see him and PQ next to each other. That in itself is going to be special in my opinion. Hopefully it's going to be special, but it's going to be special just to see that for the first time. Not expecting a huge amount of lot now, but this is PQ's. It's going to take a while because just through the Ravens history, um, I think PQ is one of the Ravens linebackers that didn't have that, that mentor in that middle because CJ Mosley had one. Um, and then, you know, we went through the brackets and then we got PQ and nobody was in the middle linebacking spot to help him and teach him. Um, because you think Raquan Smith, he had Mac. And now he, you know, he's doing his thing. You know, Raquan Smith doing his thing. So Raquan Smith can teach PQ a little something, something before he goes. Because possibly next year he might get traded. Possibly, you know. But um, let's just see how the defense will work. Uh, Raquan Smith, I believe he's going to lead the team in tackles. That's my prediction right now. He's going to lead the team in tackles his first game as a Raven. He's going to lead the team in tackles. Um, his assignment is, uh, man, they just said he got a video out too. Um, Kamara, his assignment, Kamara, he, hopefully he, uh, he continually do good against him. Um, and just shut him down because I think that's really their only weapon. And I know if somebody put in a comment, Tyson Hill, Get, get, get on somewhere with that miss. But, um, yeah, 
that's um that's really their only weapon, I believe. Because Jarvis Landry, he's gonna be limited. Him and uh, him and uh my boy MP Juice man, it's gonna be interesting to see how they. Cause I know they had a little problem, but I know I don't know if they squashed it because of that misunderstanding from the back in the day. You know, he called them homegirls and all that. He got a little, he got a little sensitive, you know. But uh, it just smacked out, you know. It just smacked out. But um, yeah. And then for as our our offense, I'm just really looking forward to see what wide receiver is gonna step up if a wide receiver does step up. Um, because I know if we killing it in the run game, we're going to just be killing it because uh, Cam Jordan is going to be uh, a problem. He's going to be a problem. So it's going to just, it's, it's, um, I have us, I do have us winning. I have us winning since, uh, since they're going to have Dalton in the back. What's my score? I say we're going to win by 10. I give us 10 plus. 10 plus we're going to win. We're going to win 10 plus. Because only reason because I say any doubt. Because the last time I seen them play, he was he was uh, he was was uh getting out early Christmas gifts, how many interceptions that man threw. And he's still the starter. Anyway. But, yeah. So, y'all tell me what y'all think. Y'all tell me what the score you uh predict. Um, see you all Monday night with the live stream. Hopefully we can continue having a good time on the live stream because we won Thursday. So that was a good time, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, everybody stay safe. God bless. Whew. And if anybody is playing that power ball and you win, show your boy some love. Cause I'm playing too. Everybody stay safe. God bless. <laughs>